Everybody knows it's Black History Month, right? So what we're going to do is talk about some black history that you may or may not know about. Well, pictured behind me, you'll see Lake Lanier, the biggest lake in Georgia. What you don't see is the small little black town of Oscarville that is buried underneath the lake. Not living in Georgia, you might not have heard of Oscarville. Oscarville is a small black town. It had 1,100 residents, and they were usually farmers or they did jobs for white people in the neighborhoods. You know, like hard work type shit. So the farmers in Oscarville, they worked with poultry. You know what I'm saying? That's part of the reason why Gainesville is the poultry capital of the world. The little community of Oscarville had schools. They had churches. They was doing very well. They had little businesses. They did great. However, with anything great black people did, it came to an end. So how Oscarville ultimately met their demise is because of this young white lady named May Crow. 18 years old, she got taken advantage of out there. They found her body beat up, and she was, you know, I'm not going to say that word. But, yeah. So, what anything white people did back then, they blamed all the black people. So, they used this to be violent towards black people in the Forsyth County area to move them out of the area, move them out of their homes, kill them if they didn't want to leave, and that's how that worked. Then they decided to put a lake over that damn little town, Lake Lanier, who was dedicated to Sydney Lanier, a Confederate soldier who fought in the Civil War. And she also was an author, I believe. So that's how you got it. Would you go tour Lake Lanier? No, you don't. It's apparently cursed. People go there all the time and die, mysteriously. It's a lot of deaths under there. So, you know, you don't want to go travel there. As beautiful as it may be, you know what I'm saying? Looks can be deceiving. Stop everybody from going? No, it's not going to stop anybody from going. Most people don't even know about Oscarville being under the lake. However, I will tell you this. That is the biggest lake in Georgia, and it does bring in $10 billion a year in tourism. So, hey, it does make money for Georgia. So why would they tell you the secret behind it?